My name is Ilias Lobin. I'm an expert and dealer of authentic ancient Greek, Roman, Biblical, Byzantine coins and artifacts. I run a website called thetrustedcoins.com where you have access to over 6,700 items available for sale. Every item I sell comes complete with its own certificate of authenticity and of course a lifetime guarantee of authenticity and my signature. I've identified over 28,000 authentication coins and artifacts over the years. Every coin that I sell comes in a professional numismatic flip. It allows you to look at the front and the back of the coin without taking it out of its protective covering. This part you could take off. It has a unique number that matches the certificate. So you could put it in your wallet, or show it to your friends, things like that, and still keep this document, let's say, in a safe place. The description of every item I sell is many times uh, attributes it to a major reference or collection. And on the back you have the historical context of the item that you have purchased. So whether you're brand new to the collecting field or you would like to learn more or you believe this as I do this it makes a great gift as a, with its presentation or if you believe as I do that this is the best investment out there you may want to check out my site Trusted Coins. Today I'm going to be discussing Aelia Flotsilla. She was a Roman Empress. This is what she looked like. This is a, I have coins of Aelia Flotsilla in my store. You may want to look inside my store and see authentic ancient coins of her. Now for her biography. Aelia Flotsilla Augusta, who died in about 385 AD, was a Roman Empress and first wife of the Roman Emperor Theodosius I. She was of a Hispanian Roman descent. During her marriage to Theodosius, she gave birth to two sons, future emperors Arcadius and Honorius, and a daughter Aelia Pulcheria. She was titled Augusta as her coinage shows. Her father was a Praetorian prefect of Gaul and Roman consul Flavius Claudius Antonius. In 375 AD, Flacilla married Theodosius I, a son of Count Theodosius. At the time, Theodosius had fallen out of favor with Valentinian I and had withdrawn to civilian life in Cauca, Galicia. The, the, their first son, Arcadius, was born prior to the elevation of his parents on the throne. Their second son, Honorius, was born on 9th of September, 384 AD. Valens, Emperor of the Eastern Roman Empire, was killed in the Battle of Adrianople on 9th of August 378 AD. His nephew Gratian, Emperor of the Western Roman Empire, was his heir and assumed control of the Eastern Empire as well, with his younger half-brother Valentinian II as his nominal co-ruler. On 19th of January, Gratian declared Theodosius Magister Militum per Illyricum to be his new colleague in the Eastern Roman Empire. Flacilla became the Emperor's consort. She worked of, char of charity, personally tending to the disabled. She died in 385. Palatium of Flacillium at Constantinople was named in her honor. A statue of her was placed within the Byzantine Senate. She is commemorated as a saint by the Eastern Orthodox Church, her feast day being 14th of September. So visit my site, trustedcoins.com, to buy authentic coins of this empress and others.